people caught on camera. What is going on, guys? Shot clips here once again, and this is going to show some wild clips of people getting caught right on camera. And my favorite clip will be at the end, so make sure to stay tuned all the way till then to find it. But in this first one, it is absolutely insane, and I can't believe this girlfriend started to do this right after she was caught cheating. This boyfriend has caught her right in the act, and I guess she has no excuse left except to, I don't know, try hanging herself in the shower and then fails miserably. Thankfully, this guy had everything recorded. I, I don't know what she was trying to plan here. I don't know if she was trying to ruin his life or something. I'm not. I'm not sure what her thought process was. This is by far one of the craziest videos I've ever seen. And thankfully, this man had his camera out or else this could have gone very, very bad. Just check how pathetic this woman is. My jaw dropped the entire video. And, and everybody see, I'm right here. Just like she did on my birthday a couple years ago when I told her grandma that she was in the bathroom beating up herself up. She mad because she out here cheating. Telling that they can get her pregnant and all that. I'm not upset. I just want her to acknowledge that she f up. But she tell my fing kid. Get out of the damn bathroom, bro. You're not gonna do crazy on my way no. Now I'm gonna pause it. What would you guys do if you guys actually saw this happen? To be honest, I would be kind of curious how far she would take it because I don't think she would really take it that far. And I'd probably just get some popcorn and laugh because this is literally hilarious. You cheated on me, she. <laughs> she broke. Dumbass. This next one's actually hilarious to lighten the mood a bit. Basically, there's this girlfriend once again caught her boyfriend cheating, or I think she was very close to at least because she saw his phone saying Domino's that it was calling him. Now, guys, I don't know about you, but Domino's never calls me, so this is definitely some other chick. And I guess to the moment he heard that Domino's was calling him, this man ran out of the shower completely butt naked. I am going to be blurring out the clip, but just check it out. It made me die of laughter. This next one is so damn embarrassing, and I can't believe people still do this in the street. Basically, this guy, I guess, was in some part of town. He wanted to steal some tires, and thankfully, this woman had her camera out protecting her car, and I guess getting this guy on film and his license plate. This guy has all the equipment in his car, so it looks like he's been doing this for quite some time, and it, it really made me surprised that people still do this. Like, people still rob, like, rims and tires. I guess four to $500 is, is more important than your life in jail, right? What are you doing? What are you doing? Huh? Nothing? 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 What are you doing? Stay right here. I suggest you stay right here. I suggest you stay right here, sir. Oh, yeah? Me over. This next one is super, super sad, and I'm happy this guy actually shared his story, even though it sucks. Basically, this guy's going around asking homeless people why they're homeless, and this man had one of the saddest stories ever. Basically, he was married to this girl after getting to know her, and then it turns out that she cheated on him with his daughter's boyfriend. Do you guys understand how messed up that is? With his daughter's boyfriend she cheated on him with. And then after getting caught, I guess the house wasn't in his name. He moved in with her. She kicked him out of the house, and then ever since, he's been homeless. Sometimes people are homeless just because they have just really bad bad luck and not that decisions were bad girl and we decided that i'd move in with her yeah. and i gave up my flat to move in with her and that a few years passed and uh, then i decided i was gonna ask her to marry me i booked a hotel in brighton and stuff before the weekend i was gonna bring her away it, i found out that she was cheating on me with my daughter's boyfriend yeah she threw, threw me out that's how like came on the streets what do you find to be the toughest part people ignoring you forgetting that you're human staying warm access to uh, showers what has been your toughest day on the streets the day i lost my dog i had her for 17 years and uh, she died before christmas the nicest thing someone has done for you people stopping and talking just like getting to know you homeless people are human the, you know you should take a bit of time out and ask them like their story then you'd be you'd be surprised about some people don't judge a book by its cover. 
In this next clip, I can't lie, it makes no sense to me. Basically, there's a woman, she caught her husband cheating on her with another woman, I guess that's a mall. Now, what she does next is kind of stupid in my opinion. She immediately grabs, I think, something off the table and throws it at the woman. Now, why are you yelling at her? It's not her fault. She probably had no idea. Like, why are you defending your husband? It makes no sense to me, and I guess people really need to figure this out. <laughs> And this next one, I'm surprised this guy did this blatantly in the open. Basically, he saw a bike and he brought like some little chainsaw with him. Like this little thing to cut the damn chain on, on the bike. No one stopped him. I'm surprised. I mean, maybe I'm not. He does have a weapon, so it could kind of get dangerous. But thankfully, some guy was recording him. And I do hope they report this to the police. Once again, for this stuff to happen in our day and age is kind of pathetic. Is this bike really worth your life in prison? I really don't think so. By the way, you guys let me know what's worse. Getting caught cheating or getting caught stealing? Is it your bike? Is that your bike? And now finally for my favorite clip on the list guys and i can't believe this actually happened on this man's wedding day basically i guess he was gay the entire time and he had like a gay boyfriend on the side or i guess he was just cheating on his wife with this guy and on his wedding day with his wife the gay boyfriend decides to crash the wedding and try pulling him out of the wedding and basically making him like rethink his decision of getting married to her his wife had no idea obviously that he was gay or that she was even getting cheated on for the fact so this is obviously very surprising to her and most likely ended the wedding check out this clip it did make me laugh i can't lie <laughs> 我干嘛呀跟我结婚吧不要问你你啥呀你闭嘴你干嘛呀你谁呀谁呀别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别别